It's through dedication and a rigorous commitment to training that our local firefighters prepare to be ready to save lives, property, and the environment in our community. They are always looking for new members to help bolster the ranks of the elite Powell River Firefighting and Rescue Services. We're always looking for, uh, certainly for people to join our team, not only with the Powell River Fire Department, but every other fire department around us. Um, all emergency services, even right down to emergency social services, are always looking for help. You know, I believe that you know there's, there's basically a job for everybody to help within a community, and you know if somebody out there is actually looking to be part of a team membership, do so. Come on down. I'll certainly talk to everybody about what our expectations are, how we can do that, how we would have you fit into into our role to help into the community, and there's certainly other aspects within the community that people can help with. So um, you know that's just the best advice I could give is just get involved and be in the community to help everybody else and help out your neighbors. This nozzle is operated in this position here, right? It's a pretty, uh, pretty interesting, exciting job when, uh, when things are happening, right? When you get involved with uh, full, fully involved structure fires, uh, it's uh, pretty exhilarating. And that's the type of thing that I think draws a lot of people to the fire service, men, women, you know, whoever. It's, uh, there's a position for everybody if you, uh, you, know, you want to put your mind to it. When I first started, I had no idea what the fire hall was about or how it worked with auxiliaries and careers. I didn't know what I was in for, and I'm so glad that I stayed. Things that I do here, I wouldn't learn anywhere else, but I can take with me for the rest of my life. I mean, I've learned lots of ropes and knots and healthcare stuff. I mean, I did my first responder course. I learned hazmat. I went away for the weekend and learned all this stuff. With the fact that we have our people well trained keeps them safe, keeps the community safe. As much as it is about skills and training, it's also about trust and teamwork. Everybody works as a team and you really become brotherhood with everybody. I mean, you got to trust who's standing next to you and it doesn't matter if you're a girl or a guy. It works both ways. We work together to teach each other. If one makes a mistake, we all pay the cost. Practice makes perfect for us. Like I said, we make a mistake and it could cost one of us our lives. It can cost a victim their life. It could cost a homeowner their house. It can cost more than we're willing to bargain with. So that's why we train every day, constantly, same thing, routine, to be able to do our job and do it at a very uh, productive and successful rate. If you're not a team, if you can't trust who you're going in the building with, then there's no point. This is the job that if you want to make a change in the world, this is the way you can do it, every day. It's awesome. It's really good. From Powell River, for Shaw TV, I'm Mike Brown.